Hey coach, so excited you found us on YouTube. Uh, make sure you subscribe and like. Second thing is make sure you go over and check out teachhoops.com for coaches who want to get better. We we have one-on-one -on -one calls, community, it's resources, it's everything that it will take to become a better basketball coach. Less time, win more games. Let me help you do that from someone that's been a nationally ranked coach and done it for 30 plus years. Go over and check it out, teachhoops.com. Let's head off to the video. So uh, one of my favorite sets here, um, it comes from Coach Izzo from Michigan State. I've used it several times at the high school level and the collegiate level um, to score a quick bucket on the side out. Um, it's a pretty simple one to implement, and it'll only take me about a minute or two to really talk it over. So you put uh, you put a player down by the block on the ball side, and then you have two players up top, usually your five and your four, and then you set your one man up to get the ball. It's the first action that you'll do. Um, you'll look to get the one, uh, and then the two then will go and come off a back screen, as you see on slide one. Slide two then, once that three-man um, sets that screen, he's going to get two screens um, off, of, off of his screen, and the one is going to dribble hard opposite where he, uh, uh, he came off of, uh, opposite of the ball side. So he's looking to create space and dribble hard. A lot of times when using this play, this play is not very successful unless um, good screening occurs. And also uh, the point guard really takes the ball the opposite direction and allows to create space for the screening and movement off of it. Um, so, and then as you can see, um, as that transpires, you're given four different options. Um, off that dribble movement you know, top of the key three um, coming back you look at the four after he screens he pops they might show he might be wide open um, which is an, uh, a nice opportunity uh, you can teach your five man to slip or dive off of the screen which you might get an option um, uh, an option off of it down here or originally if you see that the two man coming off that initial pass and the point guard takes the ball and dribbles hard early. You could see how you could hit the two man as your first option. I would say your first option is your two man. Your second option is really, I, I think the screener, the second screener um, because he can slip or he can dive after he screens. You, you'll always, a lot of times you'll get this jump shot. And then your last one is really the guy that screens and pops. But you know, you know what? After they cheat a while, you might get that action too. So you have four different options in a very simple side out of bounds play. I'm um, hoping you enjoy it. Thank you. Continue to listen to uh, continue to listen to my actions and my sets and so forth. Hopefully, they've been value very valuable to you. Thank you. Hey, coach! So glad you enjoyed the video. Subscribe and like. Before you leave, and also go over and check out teachhoops.com for coaches who want to get better. It's got everything and a roadmap for you to become a better basketball coach. So go over and check it out. And let's head back to the next video, wherever that would be.